Okay, I'm Bob and I'm making this video for my friend Suzanne who wanted to go mountain climbing for the high perspective but had some health issues and couldn't go. So I'm going to take her on this virtual trip up my sort of mountain to where I get my view. I put this camera on properly. And now you can kind of see my steps that go all the way up here. And there's a cable that spirals around this tree. <laughs> if you jump up on the first step, let's see, we're gonna aim this down a little bit. You clip in like this, and then you start going around the tree and you slide this. So if you ever start to fall, you're just stuck right where you were. I like it. I think it feels pretty safe because you've always got two different footholds and two different handholds you can hang on to. All you gotta do is slide this around the cable. Up and around. Up and around. Now we're coming to the first limb. This limb, I really appreciated it when I was trying to put these in place because I was having to do this hanging on a rope. I just couldn't cut the limb even though it's in my way. That's why I have two carabiners on here. So I can clip one in above before I clip unclip this one, keeping me safe as I go up the tree. This works. Now you gotta squeeze through this tiny space between the limb, which is tricky. Starting to seem like a long ways up. tree leans to the south, so as you get higher here, on this side you're kind of leaning backwards, so you definitely got to hold on. You come around the north side of the tree, and it's leaning away from you, you can just stand there and don't need your hands. Yeah, now we're getting where we can see the view. Let's see, time to go up. Here I quit spiraling around because it gets kind of overhung. Change my safety line. There. Sometimes it gets a little tricky to get clipped and unclipped from this cable. Okay. Finally, nice solid limbs to be sitting on. Go. Have to keep changing my belay. And we're getting there now. Yeah. 
door. Still. <coughs> Sun's kind of bright. That horizon line over there is Great Smoky Mountain National Park. It's everything beyond that ridge line. And everything between here and there is the Cherokee Reservation. And there's different national forests in the High mountains on that ridge line, but it does give you the feel like you climb something and get some view. And there's a house over there, but it's hard to see right now, hidden in the forest. I guess that's it. Hope you enjoyed the climb.